Good morning, family. I want to thank God. I want to thank King Jesus. I want to thank the Holy Spirit and the angels for another day, another opportunity to be here with you to spread love, peace, joy, truth, and hope to all who are watching. Praise God. So you remember that, that phrase that says, uh, those who cannot remember the past are, cond are condemned to repeat it. Then, you know, we're kind of living through that right now. Uh, you know, it just seems like uh, some things, you know, uh, are hard to change and, and, and God's going to have to make that change. You know, some of us are making that change, but, you know, uh, uh, God, you know, says, you know, this is going to be a different world. You know, he's changed the world from fear back to love. So, uh, you know, he's giving people a head start, you know, so they'll make sure they <laughs> make sure you're on the uh, on the side of, of God instead of the side of, of, of you know, what's coming against God, because uh, if you're coming against God, you're going to always lose. You know, make sure you're on that winning team. But this is a reading. This is out. This is Isaiah. Uh, this is at, it's at the beginning of Isaiah, and it's an awesome uh, tool that God gave me, uh, you know, this uh, Life Recovery Bible. Praise God. God is so awesome, y'all. Yeah, he give you things, man, and ladies that, that, uh, you, that he'll, he'll put, he just drop things right in your lap. It's like, pop. <laughs> Like, where'd that come from, God? <laughs> hey, I love y'all. Uh, though, it it, though it is never easy to face the truth, truth brings healing. Hey, the truth hurts sometimes, y'all. You know, just like, uh, you know, me losing my wife. I didn't want that to be true, but it was. And, and, it, and it tore my heart apart to pieces. But, uh, but, but, but when you, but truth heals also. You know, you turn to God, you know, because the Holy Spirit is, you know, is, is the truth. And Jesus brings the truth. And, and it's all falls under the umbrella of love and love heals. But, but love also will show you the truth. Sometimes the truth is not pretty. And, uh, but, but the truth is the truth. You know, that's one thing about the truth. You can't change the truth. And, and, you know, people that, that want to, you know, lie, that truth is always right there on that shoulder. Wait, you know, because at some point it's going to, it's going to, uh, it's going to uh, be shown by the light. So, you know, get in the truth, you know, uh, because, uh, if you, if you're rolling with those lies, uh, you're not going to be rolling long. Because that truth going to roll along and it's going to roll all over that lie. Praise God. God spoke through Isaiah to address the denial of the people of Judea. Well, I know about that denial as well. You know, uh, dealing with addiction. Well, you know, uh, nobody wants to. Nobody. I don't know if anyone that grew up and said, I want to be an addict <laughs> or alcoholic, you know. So, you know, and, and, you know, and society looks down on us, you know. It's like wearing that scarlet letter. And, and so, you know, uh. I lived in denial for many years until I couldn't deny it no more, you know, that the, the pressure and, you know, the pain, you know, it got so heavy, you know, and, you know, so, you know, look at things in your life where the pressure is, is heavy, you know, and that's where, you know, we turn to God, you know, because these are things, you know, that, that we can't lift on our own, but with God's help, there ain't nothing we can't lift. Praise God. Over the centuries, they had become addicted to the false promises of adultery. They had developed self-destructive patterns of behaviors that included oppressing the poor, accepting bribes, and lying to get their get what they wanted. Sounds like today, don't it, y'all? Uh, well, hey, uh, things you know, it, it, re repeating the past. <laughs> Although repeatedly confronted by Isaiah, they refused to admit their sins. Instead, they blame God for their suffering and wonder why he refused to bless them. You know, it's hard to be blessed uh, when you're uh, rolling with wickedness. But, uh, you know, read read, read uh, uh, Solomon, you know, uh, Proverbs and become wise, you know. And and, and God will bless uh, people whose hearts are, are, are just, you know, uh, you know, and whose hearts are love, you know. Be real, you know, be willing to, to go through that that healthy pain and, 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 and be honest and God can bless you, but it's hard to be blessed when you're wicked. You know, it's like a big stop sign to God. So, you know, uh, take that stop sign down and, and put that, that, uh, put that, uh, that, that, uh, go sign up that, that red, I mean, that, uh, green light on, put the green light on some of the red light and let God bless you because they enroll with just, with justice and truth and love. And God will bless you. But anyway, that's all I have today, family. Let love reign in your life. There's no relationship greater than a want. I love it and glory is greater. I love you. God bless you.
Have a blessed day. Bye.